do have to watch ads, unfortunately, for stuff like this, um, so I can get free turns and stuff, but I try not to do it too often if I don't have to. Um, I do have Minecraft on my phone, I have Stardew Valley on my phone, I have Candy Crush, I have Farm Town, what else do I have on my phone that's games? Um, I have Ludo, I can play that with friends, Hit Me Rich, which is just like a casino. I have all these games, if y'all want to see any of those, let me know. Um, so yeah, just... Just let me know. I will get on there and play with y'all. Um, I do have a Switch. Um, it's kind of difficult for me to film that off of my phone and play. But if y'all want to watch me play games on my Switch, I can figure out a setup for that. Um, I did have a video a while back. Alright, like two days ago of me playing on the Switch and my phone kept falling and I know the video quality isn't that great and I'm sorry. I'm still new to all of this, but I do appreciate y'all helping me and supporting me. Um, I would love to make this as a, even if it's part time, a job. I really do want to get a computer that can handle doing videos on. I do have a laptop, but it's not that great of a quality, and it sucks. Unfortunately, it really does suck that bad. And if y'all have games that y'all like to play with people, let me know, and I'll get on and play games with y'all too. I mean, I have no problems with that at all. the two view the viewers that I have watching please just share my content I know I'm not the greatest at speaking I know I'm not the greatest as like um content yet but I'm trying my best um there's just days where I just feel like playing games like this like it's kind of relaxing but it's it keeps my mind um Out. Um, keep my brain active. I mean, I'm not in school no more, so certain games like this does help with that, um, to keep your brain, like, I don't know how to say it, um, you know, it just helps with strategies and stuff like that. Snapping is just something that helps me think.
I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know why that was so loud. That was kind of annoying. But do not play games that um, tells you to go. That tells you, oh, you can win money for playing. It really doesn't. I know that from experience. I've played games like that, and they are very hard to actually win money off of. Um, when you get close to actually getting the um, amount to like check out, it will never happen. To do it a lot, and that's what I've learned from it. speaking and just showing support and everything I am not the greatest person but you know I try my best to be what somebody would like to look up to to support other people and I wish other people would support me like I said if you have any um, questions just go ahead and ask me I'm down to let I'm down to answer any kind of questions I've been through 
some really tough times in my life. Um, I think one of the toughest times that I've been through was the fact that I was taken away from my mom at a young age and didn't get to see or talk to her for eight years. Um, that was a really, really tough time for me, honestly. Because my mom was, like, the one person that I stayed with and knew and just getting thrown to a new situation was not fun. Um, I did go through mental abuse, physical abuse with my dad and, unfortunately, the stepmother. And these games right here aren't actually what they say either. Um, the fish them, you pretty much match and then take your fish and make your cream. And if you could tell, I do not like my stepmother. Um, Certain things may be triggered to me, but I do try to be open with y'all as best as I can. Um, it's not always easy for people to open up about their life. So some streamers will not talk about their personal life at all. Some will. I like to be open because something that I've been through could possibly help somebody else. That's why I said if you have any questions, just let me know. Sorry, my nose is kind of stuffy. I don't know why. Uh, I'm sorry, my streams have been kind of weird. learning everything about Twitch and how to get things situated. Really do want more people to come and join and just hang out and relax and ask me questions if they have any kind of questions they want answered like I'm not afraid to share my story at all opportunity to make a four there and I didn't so that's on me I'm human I make mistakes
in front of my face. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down, big boy. Lay down, big boy. Yeah. Do you have a pupper? Uh, his name is Rocky, and he's a black lab, he's a lab portocolor mix. Not black, but he looks black, so that's why my mind automatically went to black lab. Um, I used to have a black lab. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have her no more. Really does so good. He's a good pupper. I've been through so much traumatic in my life. I've lost so many animals because of everything I've had to do with in my life. Um, I've been enjoying being here in Washington. It's a pretty state. Um, there's so much stuff to go do. Um, I've gotten to go visit Forks, and that was really fun and exciting to go do. Um, that is one place I thought I would never get to go do, but I did get to go do it, and I was super excited for that. I do have clips of the trucks, Bella's trucks on YouTube if you want to go check that out. My name on YouTube is I actually kind of forgot what my Crafty Rach. So capital C R A F T Y, capital R A C H. Um, you can go check that out over there on YouTube. I've not really posted much on that lately. Um, I did get to go to, oh, I'm out of lives for that. Did get to go to, uh, the Evergreen Fairs last night. That was fun. So, I ran out of lives on Team Dodge, so I'm just going to switch over to Ludo and play some games on Ludo with some people. To Ludo. Okay. Four 
the object of the game is to get your pieces to go around the board and come up to the middle area. The only way you can get out is rolling a six. Um, it can be difficult sometimes to get six. Um, and then if you get a six, you get to roll again. And then it just, sometimes it will automatically move your pieces. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and get all my pieces out. Um, just so that they can be there and safe. And I can just move pieces along as I like. Um, but yeah. I just made that one. The gray box is pretty much once you get here, you're pretty much on the home stretch for your pieces to, um, so he just got that out. Now, if my piece was next to his and, uh, his piece landed on my piece, it could have sent my piece back into this little box where they started at. And then I would have to do it again. Um, so that's what kind of makes the, hard, the game harder. Is you don't want to get your pieces captured from other people. Um, 